So the first garment is Simplicity 9380. This was my second time making this dress. I have purchased this fabric from Hobby Lobby. It is a stretch corduroy type of fabric. And I did lengthen the ruffle piece here in the middle. And I also shortened the sleeves because they were just a little bit too long. This is Simplicity 9388. This is the shirt jacket. And it has pockets here. It has buttons down the front. And I just use these silver buttons that I purchased from Joanne Fabrics. This corduroy fabric was purchased also from Joanne Fabrics. There is a little pleat in the back. There are pockets also on the side. So you have the pockets on the front here and then the side pockets. And then you have a collar here. I also forgot to mention that I lengthened this pattern. I think the jacket was supposed to stop somewhere around in this area for the longer version, but I did lengthen it so it could go a little bit longer. Next we have Simplicity 9451. This top ended up having one sleeve because I made a mistake when I was cutting out the fabric. I cut the sleeve pattern out in the wrong direction and all I had left over was enough for one sleeve after I made the mistake. So I just ended up using one sleeve and this was the final result. This has a little opening in the back and you have to make a loop at the top or you can make a loop at the top part of the directions and then I found a gold button to add to the top. There is a center back seam. There's gathering or ruching here on the side and also up here at the shoulder edge on the right side. This is Berta 6294. This is also the second time that I made this garment. And I use the same fabric that I use for this Simplicity top, which is kind of like a stretch corduroy fabric that I found from Hobby Lobby. This has pockets and that's really it as far as the details go. Has the little band around the collar and all of that. And I actually thought that these two could be worn together. So that was really the reason why I ended up making the top. I think I made this first and then I made the top because I had some leftover fabric and I thought that they would go well together. My next sewing make is this Berta dress, which is Berta 6609. I really like this dress. I like the shaping that is created, which is created by the darts. So there are bust darts and then there are also waist darts in the back. So I really like that. There are front pockets that you can add to the dress. The dress is not lined and I did make a size 8. This fabric is some fabric that I found from a thrift store. It is wool fabric and I really like it a lot. I really love the pockets and there is also an invisible zipper in the back. So I've made videos of all the other four sewing makes that I shared before I showed this dress. And so I will put links in the description if you want to see what the garments look like on. And before I go, I want to leave you with a love share. I recently learned that you need to have a permit if you intend on feeding the homeless in streets or parks in the city of Atlanta, Georgia.